Hello, hello. I am Misty Lee Johnson, an elite consultant with Paparazzi Accessories and the proud leader of Team Grateful. I'm here today to go a little bit further into party hostesses. We've been talking about A S K. A is for ask, S is for say it, and K is for keep on saying it. So please go watch that video on how to secure and have successful hostesses. The next thing I want to talk to you about is now you have that hostess, what are you going to do with her? Well, I'm going to share one fun idea that I do on my shows with our party hostesses. And in our shows, we actually call them the party queen. So the first thing while we are communicating with our hostesses before the live event, remember our three C's, one of those is communicate, right? While we're communicating, I ask her what number does the queen want for the bucket drawing? All right, so she gives me a number. Let's say she says, I want number 38, it's my lucky number. I'm like, okay, queen, Andrea, your number is 38. So at the end of the show, when we do the drawing, if we draw 38, you can win part of the bucket. You might be saying right now, what is the bucket? Why are we calling her queen? And where in the world is the number coming in at? Well, let me tell you, the night of my show, all right, I put a bucket of, for me, it's 20 pieces together because my goal is to sell 200 pieces in a show. So I go through my inventory and I pull out 20 pieces of amazing jewelry and I lay it in three jewelry trays and I take a picture of it from above and I edit it on my phone and I put it in my story and I have this little jumping icon and it says, who's gonna win the bucket tonight? And you wouldn't believe how many people message me and say, that bucket is mine. That bucket is smoking. I can't wait to see who wins the bucket. I hope it's me. That's gonna build interaction, but my customers know that this is what I do, okay? So then let's fast forward to now it's time for the live show. It's Queen Andrea's party and we are live and people are coming in. They have to say a key word. And when I have a hostess, that key word is queen, whatever the queen's name is. So we're gonna use Andrea as an example. Queen Andrea, when I see that in the comments, I know that she's, gonna, she's going to get a number. So no purchase necessary to win. This is how you will keep this compliant. Anybody who's there at the end of the show who has a number, right, by saying the keyword that I give them, which in this example, we're using Queen Andrea, whoever does that, if they are present at the end of the show, if I draw their number, they win the bucket. Okay, our buckets are big, so we split it between three people. And believe it or not, that's at the recommendation of my customers. They said more people should be able to win. So now we split it into three. So we draw three numbers. Um, but just remember to keep that compliant. You wanna make sure that you stress there's no purchase necessary to win. However, you can require them for to be present at the end when the drawing takes place. And I do require that. All right, so it's no purchase necessary. Now, the reason I do the bucket game is because I'm showing people how hostess rewards are earned at the same time that my party queen is earning hostess rewards. Well, Misty, you're giving away two pieces then for every 10 that sells. Correct. Because I am a platinum seller with paparazzi. And one of the benefits of that is that I get double hostess rewards. If you are a new consultant in paparazzi or this is a new paparazzi year, your goal for this year should be at least gold um, level life of the party because one of the benefits of gold level paparazzi and above is double hostess rewards. So now you can see why every time I have a party queen, I do the bucket. My clients know that if I don't have a party queen, we're not doing the bucket. All right. But I will give away free prizes during the show. We still have lots of fun, but that's how I keep the premium on my hostess parties. All right. So make sure that you are shooting for life of the party gold. Like that's your goal. Okay. You want to, you can break it down. There's plenty of images out there where people have broken it down 
to how many pieces you need to see a, sell a week, but that's for another video. So for right now, let's continue to talk about the bucket. I'm gonna take you behind the scenes and show you the pieces that I picked for a recent party. All right, and then I just pull one piece out. Every time 10 pieces sells, I just pull one piece out from this tray and put it in the little shipping bag that I have or the little bag that I have that I put my opened jewelry in before I ship it. Okay, and you can see we've got some urban in there. We've got some rhinestones. There's a blockbuster or two in there. I've got some fringe in there. I do not put run-of-the-mill pieces in my bucket. I make it attractive. I hype it up. I'm consistent in publishing it in my story. I also send this picture to my hostess and I'll let her know, this is the bucket tonight if you wanna give your peeps a sneak peek. And when the party opens, as they're saying the welcome word, which in our example, we're using Queen Andrea, as they keep saying the welcome word and getting their numbers for the drawing, you know, I will say who peeked at the story tonight or who got a picture of this from the queen in their messenger. Some people like to just be surprised and other people are like, oh my gosh, I had to peek. There's so many pieces in there I want. Well, girl, you can't buy it. You got to win it. And I do like to use pieces that are last chance items or one and done's or maybe pieces that were repossessions that somebody let go of. And so that gives an attractiveness. Please do not be afraid to put good stuff in your bucket because that is actually what will draw the crowd to you okay so in a nutshell um the bucket is when i have a party queen i'm giving away two pieces every time 10 pieces sell one goes to my party queen and one goes to my crowd and this increases engagement my customers love it they tune in for every show and they're always talking about hey girl come watch the show even if you don't get anything you might be lucky enough to win and i'm telling you that increases my viewers it increases my audience and it has definitely increased my sales so go out there have fun and i can't wait to see your bucket parties have a blast